My name is Clyde Williams. If you had told me 20 years ago that I would have the honor of escorting civil rights icon Rosa Parks, sparring with the greatest, and meeting a living legend, I would have never believed it. These icons all inspired me, but it's my mother who shaped me, instilling the values of hard work, integrity, and service. My father died when I was three, so my mother mainly raised me and my siblings. We didn't have much. At one point, my mother worked two jobs to make ends meet, but she also made sure we had big dreams. When she took me to see the White House as a baby, she couldn't imagine that I'd end up working for two presidents. I moved to Harlem in 2001 to work as domestic policy advisor for President Clinton, where I led efforts to support the Upper Manhattan community. There, I met some great people, like David. Like many young people who live uptown, David struggled to finish his education. He told me about a particular school that he really wanted to go to. It was hard for me to get in school. I had a learning disability at that time. He must have said something really good to them. I stood there for about two years, fixed my dyslexia, and here I am now. From there on, I'd, I'm forever in his debt. You see a person who is happy and who's successful. He realized his dream of owning a home. Man, I just want to tell you thank you for everything you've done for me, man. While working for President Clinton, I spearheaded the Harlem Small Business Initiative. I knew we had entrepreneurs uptown with incredible drive, determination, and creativity. How's business? Business is a hustle, but we're doing it. But I also saw that many of these businesses needed new tools to be competitive. One of the things we realized is that the Harlem businesses needed technical assistance, uh, not just capital. One of those businesses was Harlem's Heaven Boutique on 147th Street, owned by Yvetta Petty a gifted hat maker. I just want you to show you the newest addition to the store. Mm -hmm. Because of the website, we ship to customers all over the world now. She has a thriving business now, but six years ago, when the Harlem Small Business Initiative program began working with her, she was on the verge of shutting her doors. It kept us from going out of business, that's for sure. We did everything from renegotiating to leases, writing a marketing plan, a business plan. If it had not been for the Clinton Initiative, we would be gone. I'm forever indebted to you and, well, and, you. and all of the foundation. I spent my career in public service and business, focusing on helping others to work towards their goals and realize their dreams. I received that type of support when I was a child. Now it's my highest priority as a husband and as a father. We all share the same hope. We want the best for our families, quality schools for our children, good jobs for our community. To get there, it takes innovative ideas, experience, energy, and leadership. My name is Clyde Williams. Visit Clyde2012.com and join our journey as we continue to move uptown forward.